that he knows that uh, um, uh, it's a Brian Broadcasting thing, but he's felt that it's really is his legacy and is something that he's put all his heart into. And we could not agree anymore. Uh, I don't think that we have anywhere near uh, the presence that 1550 had had in this community if it wasn't uh, Tom and for, for all his amazing work. He really has been a blessing to, to us and, and we hope he's been uh, a, a similar blessing to, to you guys. I, I'm pretty sure everyone here would, would agree. Do you want to come up and say a few words? I mean, it's your, I know you've got a few more days left on the radio. This isn't your official farewell, but... Oh, you know, I didn't, never knew retirement would be this hard. But uh, I, 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 I want to tell everyone that I'm not retiring from the community. I'm just getting off the radio, that's all. So don't look for me for a while because I'm going to take some serious time off, but I'll be back. I'm not sure what my next assignment will be. Uh, I had no idea that, you know, Navicenter News would pop up. I'm sure something else will pop up. I'm looking into a few things, but God led me here and uh, I'm not leaving. I'm just leaving the radio. So I'll be back with something. And yes, the flute's still here. Yes, the Christmas fudge is still here. You know, so that, that's not going to change. Uh, so far as, as being a blessing, Brian, Broadca Brian Broadcasting, they really appreciate Navasota and Grimes County. And uh, they have always been supportive of me. And they've got. I just met Kenny this morning, been working with Andre for about a week, and he's all right. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, he's an Aggie, but don't hold that against him. He's a good writer, and uh, you know, seriously. <coughs> seriously, I, Brian Broadcasting has been the best place I've ever worked. This man right here, Ben Downs, he's an amazing person. Uh, I don't know if you know about uh, up at the mothership, he does some amazing stuff up at the mothership and uh, coordinating all these wonderfully talented people. And uh, so leaving for me is kind of a mixed blessing. I do need some time off. You know, I mean, I have, I've, I have, in my 70 years, I have come across two rules that are inviolate. If I've learned that whenever I violate either one of these rules, I get in serious trouble. And my number one rule is listen to your body. My body tells me that I need some time off. So that's what I'm going to take. But it really is, it really is mixed feelings because, uh, because I love all the people at Bryan Broadcasting. I love all the people at Navasota and Grimes County, you know, and I'm just, I'm happy that God has put me here and He's still put me here. I mean, I'm still here. Just my, my assignment is changing. That's all. So thank you for all the good words. Um, I mean, in commissioner's court this morning, they gave me a standing ovation for God's sake. You know, I mean, forgive them, Father. They know not what they do. Oh, Tom. Yes, sir. I, I've got a cat joke I wanted to tell you. <laughs> a cat no, joke? No, 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 no. Just kidding. <laughs> Thank you, Dan. I deserve that. <laughs> go for it. You know, it's just a go for it. You Thank you. Huh? You can do one. A cat joke? No, just any joke. Just one. Let us remember. Let us remember you by this. Okay. What do you what do you call a crocodile with a compass? What do you call a crocodile? with a compass. That would be a navigator. Yeah. And with that all done.